What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel to another episode of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer. A uh, little disclaimer before we get too far into it. The last video that I uploaded was uh, uploaded successfully. Thank the Lord. Um, I've been having a whole lot of... Man, I've been having a whole lot of electronic issues and stuff. But anyway, when I went to go back and load this back up, the save file was corrupted and reverted back to the previous save file. In other words, it was like I hadn't done the previous episode. So I blew through all the fights uh, before off screen and went ahead and got us back up to where we were. As you can see, it's a little different. Um, yeah, and I forgot to heal up my champ and stuff uh, from the off-screen shenanigans. He is burnt. Uh, but, um, yeah, my champ, I went ahead and got him up a couple of levels. We'll go ahead and do a team recap because, yeah, we, um, yeah. See, he, uh, he picked up Vital Throw uh, last level which is something that I don't believe I did in the previous episode and I hate that I've been having so much trouble but you know it's just comes with the territory I suppose C. Leo, C. Leo is also down a level I think I wanted I got him up to level 39 or 40 last episode I don't really remember but um, we still have Ice Ball, Roar Beam, Water Gun and Body Slam with him Ingar I haven't touched with Hypnosis, Confused Rage, Remeter, and Shadow Punch. Scat Cat, as always, with Payday, Faint Attack, Bite, and Cut. Level 34, I think he went up an extra level. Maybe two? No, he just went up one level. Charizard, I got up to level 35. I don't remember if I got him to level 35 last time. But I do know that we ended up with Flamethrower before the end of the episode. So we went ahead. I went ahead and got him with uh, leveled up to get flamethrower and bud bud did not put in hardly any work he did a little bit uh in my off screen shenanigans but not a whole lot and uh that's kind of stinks because i really leveled him up a lot last time i think that was mostly what i focused on was leveling him up and here we are back at the start where we were two episodes ago at level 33 but that's okay because we're here now and we're gonna do it so the first thing I want to do is swap out uh, my champ actually I hate to do this but I'm going to run outside to the Pokemon Center and get some heals yeah the upload schedule has been really awkward last couple days um, simply because I have been having so many issues with the um, with uploading oh yeah I think we're I, I don't think I went up here and did anything so now nah, we're going around here Oop, too fast let's just turn it off um but I have been having a whole lot of electronic difficulties. Some of y'all may have seen the uh, gab gab post that I made. I am one of the Fort Rocket Brothers. Some of y'all may have seen that, and y'all know I've been struggling greatly um, trying to get everything sorted out. But it looks like we are. Uh, it looks like I'm getting there. Haven't had any issues the last day or two. I've uh, been working on some other stuff. Some uh, other stuff. Other stuff for other things. Oh, uh, but, but come on, man. Ah, oh, come on, man. Uh, here we go. Here we go. But uh, anyway. Enough of my belly aching. I hope y'all have had a fantastic day. I hope to uh, upload this later today. I am recording this right now. It's right now. It's uh, Sunday afternoon. Just got home from church a few 
a few minutes ago. I want to go ahead and get some recording in. Yeah, boy, my champ. Come on with it. And uh, I'm hoping to get a little bit of recording in. Oh, he lived. Oh, that stinks. But anyway, this week is going to be very interesting for me. Uh, tomorrow, ooh, Rhyhorn. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to risk it. I think he can do quite a bit of damage. But I think this confusion will take him out. Yes, there we go. Anyway, I'm going to have an interesting week. We're going... Tomorrow is Labor Day. Um, so, I hope y'all have a excellent uh, Labor Day holiday. And, uh, ooh, soft sand. Demarcus' boss is terribly cruel to him. Pokemon are just tools to be used. What will happen if that tyrant takes over our company? That's a pretty picture of a Pokemon. Looks like it's feeling good. Wait, can I rest here? No. Okay. But, um... Wait. It's in here. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right, that's right, that's right. Hello. That's as far as you'll go. Yeah, I hope y'all have a wonderful Labor Day uh, weekend. Articuno. My dude. Goodbye. Please, please goodbye. I don't know, he's got pretty high spadef. He's got a ridiculously high spadef. Um, but yeah, tomorrow we're going to go try... Try to go out. Celebrate my sister's birthday, get together, and, you know, have a little family dinner or whatever. And he got the freeze, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh. This is redonk. This is redonk a donk. Um, okay, okay, okay. I'll we'll go with Charizard. I'm gonna try and celebrate my sister's birthday tomorrow as a family. And then going to be working two days this week and then I'm going to be off out of town at the Fight Laugh Beast conference. I am so stoked. Y'all don't even understand how stoked I am. I'm just going to have a whole bunch of uh, whole bunch of rowdy Christians getting together and getting together we're going to be learning about uh, the uh, politics of sex is the theme this year and how it is inherently political because our ooh, wing attack baby um, we are definitely not going to pursue that we've got fly which is a much better move so we will go ahead and x nay that But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm stoked to be going to back to Fight Life East Conference and seeing some old friends that, uh, seeing some old friends that I've been friends with online for years. Don't really get to see them at all because they're from all over the country. From Cali, from uh, Idaho, from just everywhere. Virginia, North Carolina. But uh, we're going to get together and we're going to have a grand old time. Not enough grit. We're going to have an awesome time. Just chilling, hanging out, and uh, chilling and hanging out and worshiping the Lord and edifying one another. I'm one of the four Rocket Brothers. Oh, oh. Golly, bum, what's with these legends, yo? And I forgot to swap my bud. Hey, wait a minute. You know what? I've got one. I'm going to use it. I do have one. I'm going to use it. Alright, bud, bud. Let's boogie. 
Yeah, that's right. Boom, son. Yeah, I've got to get a lot of recording done. Because I'm not going to be able to not going to be able to record away from here and by not um, wow okay that was interesting okay 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 we're gonna stop the real talk for just a second and I want to explain what just happened vital throw um, what it does is it makes you go last okay um, Hey, my champ leveled up. Booyah. There we go. So, what um, Vital Throw does is it make... It, it's supposed to make you go last. Okay. Um, but it, what it does is because it makes you go last... See, watch. See. Because it makes you go last, um, it doesn't miss. So, it's more than 100% accuracy, it always hits. Um, I think unless you are, you know, I'm not sure if it works on uh, dig, dive, fly, things like that, you know, where they're, where they're away. I don't know if it works there. Um, it may do. I, I really don't know. I don't have any way to test it. Um, I can look it up, but, you know, I ain't going to. Right, brothers, I lost! But, um, okay, so what must have happened right there was Ho-Oh used Whirlwind, which is also a low-priority move, which means it is supposed to go last. Um, but Vital Throw apparently has a higher priority in the range of low priority moves than Whirlwind does. So that's why that was really interesting to see bottom throw hit first. Um, there's a whole lot of mechanics in this game that a lot of people, I wouldn't say take for granted, but don't really think about. Yeah, here we go. Uh oh, I smell a little mouse. <clears throat> Excuse me. But there's a whole lot of mechanics in this game that a whole lot of people just take for granted. And whenever you get into the, um, whenever you get into, like, the more competitive aspect, or when you try to, you know, play online or, uh, you know, Pokemon Showdown, stuff like that, these are things that you have to know. And that's just one of the things that. I remember from, from uh, you know, back in the day. But uh, yeah, it's just little stuff like that, that, that the little tweaks and the little things like that uh, that are um, very interesting, very interesting to me. Because, see, even if you have a uh, higher speed stat, if your move is a lower priority move, it will, you'll move last because your speed is low priority. Which is one reason why, especially in the competitive, well, in the competitive scene when I was more into it, um, you had hyper offensive teams which were, um, I'm talking lightning fast, priority for days, um, and then you had, uh, I don't know if it's still popular now, but you had, <clears throat> excuse me, um, Trick Room users. And what Trick Room does is it flips all the speed stats on their head so you can take like a really slow Pokemon and with a low priority move, uh, or, or just take a slow Pokemon a a in general and, um, you, you set up with Trick Room, and then you won't find my boss just scurrying around. 
Um, but if you take and you flip, you know, take those speed stats and swap them. Fluffy tail. That's useless. And here we go. Hehehe, <laughs> you mistook me for a silforka. But you're taking that speed stat, that hyper offensive, hyper quick speed, speed, uh, speed team, and then you're countering it by taking all that speed that they have and using it against them, which is really, really interesting and was really, really annoying. But um, you know, it's just, uh, it is what it is. You take those mechanics and you learn them, and then you use them to your advantage. So, that's just something that, uh, you know, didn't mean to deep dive on that a little bit, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> oh, come on, Bubba, there we go. Get that mega punch. Oh, crap. Uh-uh, I ain't dealing with this garbage. No, 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 no. I'm outie. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use priority in order to counteract this. Fang attack moves first. Plus Scat Cat's faster. So boom. There we go. He's trying to uh, take every take my mind with him what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take and I'm gonna use that priority move that scat cat learns and I'm gonna take and get out of that situation you know what I mean now here it just really don't matter Cascoon's gonna live and he's gonna do the whole yep he's gonna harden because that's all he can do mm 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 Man, that sunlight. I'm telling you, these animations... The animations for the... Um, weather is... They can really lengthen out battles. Which is why... I think this is like the Sandstream run. I'm doing... I mean, this is the Sandstream run. It's about your age, you are skilled trainer. Thank you. So, let's see, where'd I come from? If you don't turn back, I'll call for backup. Can I go here? Ooh. I'm trying to remember where I'm at. If your Pokemon have weak points, I can nail them. Juggler Kim sent out Dunspores. Boom. Oh, it's a crit. Let's go, baby. Chin Chow. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, here we go with the dang drought. I'm telling you. Well, if you remember. That's right, we got that vote absorb. Boom. Got him. Hand hats are crit, too. Holy crap. Let's go. Let's go. Lombre. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I've always liked. I like the long brace design. Ludicolo, I don't like. It's just a, it's just a fun design. It's just a fun design, you know. Mm mm mm. All right. Confusion. Boom. Goodbye. Okay. Hey, my champ. Yeah, give me them plus five attacks for days, baby. 
Exploding weak spot does work. Think about type advantages. Yeah, just whoop the snot out of you. I'm trying to take over the place. Give me fighting advice. Love it. Absolutely love it. All right, we're going to go ahead and take this experience share. We're going to put it on the Bud Bud. So we're going to give Bud Bud the experience share because I want Charizard out here front and center because I want him to put in some work. Hey, my dude. All right, are you good? Really, bro? I heard a kid was wandering around. Yeah, I was. Shed Ninja. Wow, I could not have done any better. 10 to 1, I think I got Wonder Guard, though. So, either way, I'm good. Okay, and if you don't know, Shed Ninja is what happens when Ninjask evolves. I'm sorry. Um, is it Ninjask Evolves? I don't remember who the... No, it's Ninkata. Evolve, when Ninkata evolves into Ninjask, if you have an open slot on your team, a Shed Ninja is formed as well. And he has a... Uh, just a broken... Fight me, boy. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry about the yawning. It's about time for my Sunday afternoon nap. Y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Shed Ninja, Wonder Guard, is the one of the most broken, absolutely broken uh, abilities. Because... And Shedinja only has one HP, ever. That's all he ever has, one HP. Um, because Wonder Guard moves do not hit unless they are super effective. Which for Shedinja is, you know, he's a bug ghost, if I remember correctly. Yeah, but but a fancy. Um, I'm just gonna stay in. I think chores are probably Rick roll the rest of these boys. Uh, but you know, flying ghost or not flying ghost. I'm sorry. A bug ghost has quite a few weaknesses, which is you know okay, no biggie, right? Usually you can just take care of it with a fire mon or a um, you know you can take care of it with a fire mon, flying mon. You know there's just a whole bunch of of different ways around that one card. However, the scary part is when you're in a randomizer, there are some Pokemon that have very, very, very few weaknesses. And actually, in a later, uh, I think it's, this is, Fire Red is third gen? Yes, Fire Red is third gen. In, um, gen, pardon me, near? I have not. Show Team Rock a little respect. In, um, fifth gen there are there is one mon that has uh, one one weakness I think and combined with his normal ability he has no weaknesses uh, which is uh, levitate it is uh, electros if you want to look it up but or you know it but um, think about it if you have an electros with uh, wonder guard yeah. Which might be coughing evolves in a wheezing. Alright, I think we get something here. What? There should be children here. 
Yeah, dude's probably got the car key. Champion landed. Uh, but yeah. So imagine you have exactly one move or uh, one type that can actually hit. Yeah. Um, especially, and y'all know, y'all know the difficulty I've had with getting. Um, y'all know the difficulty I've had in getting the. Uh, uh, like grass moves because I mean this stuff is this stuff is randomized a whole lot so finding a decent grass mon with some decent grass moves I ain't found a whole lot oh goodness you're only on the fifth floor it's a long way to the boss Bud, I will settle for a card key. Mm -mm -mm. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Here we go. Let's back out. My dude, the card key. Alright. There goes my timer, but what we're going to do is we're going to go just a little bit long today. Because we still have a lot to do in this. Bingo. We still have a lot to do to get out of here. TM2 Crush Claw. I have no idea what that move is. I literally do not have any idea. It was, what, two? Dude. Crush Claw. Foes attack with sharp claws. May also lower the foes defenses. 75.95. Who learns this? Who can learn it? Bud Bud and Charizard. That's a dope move. That is a dope move. I will take it. Alright, now we're on the third floor. What's up, y'all? I work for Silco. What am I to do? Flee! Flee for your lives! <laughs> yeah, right. Look for some sort of favorite diagrams and texts. Thunderstone! Booyah! Alright, alright, alright. Oh, here we go. Quit messing around. Uh, quit messing with us, kid. I do, do, do. Zig Zagoon. It's about to be roasty toasty. And he got that sand stream, yo. He got that sand stream, yo. Let's go ahead and fight up on I ain't got a whole lot of PP for flamethrower left. Mm -mm -mm. That's one thing about getting a good move, man. <laughs> you, uh, it never has enough PP. I don't care what move it is, it never has enough PP. Mm -mm -mm. Oh boy. I'm 37, baby. Let's go. And Torkoal. Alright, alright, alright. Here we go. That's alright. Come on, Sandstorm. Golly bomb. Um. Hmm. Try Metal Claw. I don't think it'll do a whole lot, though, because it's fire and rock. Alright. Okay. And now I bet I can't. Yeah, I'm trapped. Yep. This was stupid. That was stupid. I should I should just swapped out. I know that I should just swapped out. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let's go, big boy. Whoo! And that was not very effective too. So that's like half. Uh, that was half damage. How you like them apples, son? I'm telling you, Charizard should learn Flamethrower like 15 levels ago. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Good job. Good job. 
I am not swapping out, actually. Jinx. A wild Nicki Minaj appears. <laughs> uh, that's funny. A wild Nicki Minaj appears. Mm -mm -mm. And she gone. I give up. Yeah, you better give up. Hint, you can open doors with the car key. No. No kidding there, bud. Alright, so what we're going to do, we're just going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Actually, we'll wrap it up right here. And I'm going to save. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back. And I'm going to save it again here in like 30 seconds after we finish this up. Because that way I'll have save spot in the same state in case this gets corrupted. Anyway, I hope you all have an excellent day. And I hope you enjoyed this admittedly kind of a strange episode. But it is what it is. We're back, baby. Let's go with it. So anyway, I hope you have an awesome day. Leave a... Uh, Leave an upvote if you like this video. Leave a downvote if you don't. Comments telling me why you did or didn't like it. And be sure to subscribe if you want more. Like I said in the last one, I am working, uh, going to be starting a new LP soon. You heard it here first. Uh, and it is going to be Metal Man, uh, blah, 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 Mega Man Battle Network. The first one. One of my all-time favorite games and also this is the start of one of my all-time favorite series and um i cannot wait to get started on this one it's going to be dope it's going to be awesome you're going to love it so anyway i hope you enjoy god bless